and welcome back to the channel on this video I'm riding the ride one up cafe cruiser <clears throat> I'm in pedal assist 3 and I'm in gear 8 like I usually am and on this video I want to talk about <clears throat> let me clear my throat here excuse me about that um, I want to talk about e-bike sales strategies and I've noticed something that's been going on more and more especially in the last year I'd say or maybe even a little less than that but it's it's like other companies are jumping on board of this and what it is is I don't know if you've noticed this but instead of giving you a discount on the uh, bike price what they're doing now, a lot of them are, they're throwing in, well, they're throwing in accessories as an incentive to buy the bike. So basically they'll give you the, so they'll have the package where you get the bike for the regular price of the bike. Let's say it's $1,200. This is just an example. Then they'll give you a bundle of about $350 worth of accessories for free. So what they do is they tell you the price of the accessories and the bike and then take off the accessories price and say, here's how much you're saving on buying this bike. So basically you're not saving anything on the bike itself. You're just getting the accessories for free. And so, um, but I'm seeing more and more companies doing that. Um, so if you're into accessories, that's probably a good thing, but a lot of times you really want all the accessories when they throw in things that you're probably not gonna use or you already have maybe, um, or you wanna buy your own you know you don't want to have there maybe you want a better one or whatever like say it's a phone holder and you want to get uh like i'm haven't purchased it yet but i'm going to purchase me the the quad uh lock um phone mount that's what i want and maybe they're going to throw in one as part of the thing the deal and you don't want that one you know maybe it's not as good a quality as you want to get so that's how they're kind of doing it and i don't know what you think of that but I mean, it's good and all, but it's not as good to me as taking money off the bike and then let me decide which uh, accessories I want to buy. I mean, maybe that's just me, but that's the way I would prefer it. So if it's a $1,200 bike and say they're giving you $200 worth of accessories, I'd just as soon take the $200 off the price of the bike and sell me the bike for 1000 than giving me the accessories. And I noticed too, Something else about this is that I've noticed that they're giving you uh, as uh, one of the accessories a lot of times fenders. Like, come on, guys, let's <laughs> give us the fenders with the bike. I mean, that should be on the bike. And then when they say the lights, if they say the lights are included, well, gee, I think lights should be on this. Uh, in on that particular bike and on if we're talking about a, a package or on all bikes I think that that should be a mandatory thing on every bike There should be a brake light a tail light a headlight and turn signals And really I think they should have mirrors on every bike Give you a mirror that should be part of the bike because um, if you're going to be riding on the road, especially, but even on a bike path, you still need to have all that. Um, then you should be equipped with safety. But that uh, accessory packages, let me know what, you, uh, what your thoughts are on that. Are you in agreement? Do you like what the companies are doing or would you prefer like myself to just take that money off of the uh, price of the bike? 
I noticed one company that's been doing it for quite a while, and they might have been one of the first to be doing it, but I really noticed it. And they're doing it a lot now. Like, it seems like every bike almost has this, they have these packages going on, and that's electric. I know electric will sell their, like, their 2.0, and then it'll be whatever the price is, $1,000. And then they'll add the price of all the accessories, 300 and something dollars of, of accessories. And then they'll say, you get the bike, it's worth this much money. So $999 uh, plus, I'm just using this, I don't know the exact price, but let's just say $999 plus $350 for accessories. So you're getting for $1349, you're getting the bike for $999 kind of thing. Well, the bike isn't really 1349 that's with the accessories so anyway that's how i noticed that um i know electric for sure is doing it and several other uh, companies are jumping on board sometimes it's only a couple of accessories and sometimes it's like six of them or even more like big packages lots of lots of different accessories So let me know in the comments what you think of that. Are you in agreement with the companies? Do you like the way they're doing that? Or would you rather have, like I said, uh, I would prefer the uh, price just knocked off the bike and I'll buy the accessories that I want when I want or whatever. And uh, let me know in the comments if you've been noticing that yourself too. Um, a lot lately. I've, I've been seeing more and more of that, like I say in the past, within the last year, maybe less than that, but it seems like there's more and more of those uh, jumping on board with that. All right, well, that's going to do it for this video. Hey, if you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. And if you'd like to subscribe to the channel, just hit that subscribe button. And thank you very much for supporting us. If you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, just hit the notification bell and you'll get the notification. We usually put a video up every single day and uh, sometimes two usually, like a short at 4 a.m. my time, which would be 7 in the east. And the regular video long form goes up usually every day at 9 a.m. local time here and 12 o'clock noon in the east. Uh, so uh, look for that and uh, if you want to comment like I said on this or any other video uh, go ahead and leave that in the comments below once again thank you for joining me on this video and until next time keep your wheels on the road see you later